All right, so today we're going to be editing our GNOME shell theme by removing the application icon in your top panel, right? So every time you click on an application or launch one, you know, it'll have a little icon here, right? Um, the theme I'm using today is called Fiance or Fiance. I can just, I'll go ahead and uh, put a link in the description to the, to the theme if you want to try it out. There's also an icon set that goes with it. It's really nice. It's real uh, simple, you know, just a basic black with a nice little transparency. But anyways, like I said, I just don't really like the uh, the icon here. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of that today. Uh, it's fairly simple to do. Basically, you're just going to be uh, removing a, a little bit of code out of the uh, um, shell um, dash CSS file or dot CSS file in your theme, your shell theme. So depending on where you have your, your GNOME shell themes installed at, you know, if you use a synaptic package manager or whatever, It'll be in your root directory under user share um, themes. But for me, I just download my themes off the internet and I just put them in my home folder in your dot theme folder. So that's, when, that's where I'm going to go today. So control H dot themes uh, fiance or fiance. Here it is right here. I'm going to go ahead and back it up. So just copy it here for now. There we go. It's my backup. Let's go ahead and open it up your gnome shell and it's right here gnome-shell.css so the thing about this is m most likely uh, the part you can be modifying will be in here but for this particular theme um, it says to import right add import URL whatever so since we're gonna, since we're gonna be messing with our, our panel it's gonna be our panel.css right so let's go ahead and look for that here it is right here Okay, now here's a little uh, string of code we're gonna you know replace. So let's double click this. Should open up another tab right here. So now we gotta find this right here. This dot panel you know dash button uh, you know app menu icon. Copy that. Click back in here. Search, find, right click and paste. And here it is right here. So we're going to start here and we're going to end about right here, this little bracket right here. So let's go ahead and copy all this. Click back in here where it says dot app menu icon, whatever. This last little bracket. And stop right here. Hit backspace and paste. And there we go. Now save it. Now I'm going to go ahead and stop recording because every time I reload GNOME Shell, it just crashes with the recorder on. So I'll be back in a second so I can reload the shell. All right, I'm back. And as you can see, there's no more icon in your panel. Right, no matter what you click on, you know it's not there anymore. So, anyways, like I was saying before, um, if you install in your, if you install the theme through your through your Synaptic Package Manager or through a terminal or your Software Center or whatever, it'll be in your root directory. So let me just go ahead and show you um, where it's at real quick. So let's go ahead and type uh, GKSU. N A U T. I L U S Nautilus. All right. Go to your file system. Go to user or USR. Share themes. Right, and I think this is one that that I installed. Here it is, right here. Same same thing, you know. Just find your uh, GNOME shell. Here it is. CSS and just uh, go ahead and uh, do your thing I guess you know what I mean so that's it for that and if you have any questions feel free to ask you know no big deal and uh, see you guys later